What's up, party people? It is your boy, voice back. Let's just start. Let's just keep going, my boys. In the last video, we um, kind of fleshed it out and tanned it, and now it's all good. I put the vice over there because it, it was over there. And now I put it over there, so I can do like this. So now I'm going to I'm going to stitch that together because it's whipped over here. But you see, it turned great because of the formula. Okay, let's let's just start. It's it's time for I think a good old time lapse. Guess I'm Hello, I'm going to read some more comments right now. You see me doing some stuff again, probably stitching it all together. Okay, first comment is from Ava. Poor start, I love it. Also, to text it, me. greetings from Let's. Bis denn in well weg von meiner Sö. So, not bei uns, von meiner Sö. Let's go and open this up. Keine Ahnung. Um, gutes Herz. I need to learn this method, but you don't, you don't teach easy. This is my subscribe. Yeah, I already know that. Me and Gutes Herz, we have had some great conversation in the live stream. So if you see me live streaming, come join, have some awesome conversation with me. Me and Gutes Herz, we had some good time. Yeah, and before I forget, uh, me and Gutes Herz, we've talked for a little bit. And over here you have the good old ingredients. Do you see them? Oh, no. Focus. My lamb. Natural Loch, Kalium Aluminium Sulfate, Natrium Hydroxide, Formalin and Water. I use that to brush the, the skin. And I use that one. <coughs> Ingredients are in fucking Dutch. Svavelsur, Meerensur, Ammoniac, Natrium Chloride, Water and al Alum. Probably. I don't know what that means. But that is in there. That is the thing that I've used to syringe that in there. Let's go back to, to co reading comments. Very nice, yes. Reading comments with Lois. K3 Fox. Dead fish are the most terrifying thing to me. Not sushi or prepared. I mean intact with eyes that particularly decomposed. Decomposed. There we go. So. Me being curious about your process process and retarded at the same time, I clicked. You're awesome. Your taxidermy is awesome. Still scares the shit out of me. I wouldn't want that display near me. I would freak out and die. Good video though. Thanks, man. Dude, comments like this just warm my heart. So nice. Always gives, gives me a, a reason why I make videos. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Like, really cool. Chiara Delo. Deloy. There we go. Chiara Deloy. Can you do a fish or a chicken? That would be nice. Yeah, sure. Um, I'm doing a pheasant, so that's kind of like a chicken. It's pretty much like a chicken. But yeah, I can do a chicken. No problem. More animations. So what kind of phone is that? Is it that you use for the head? I'm going to make my own taxidermy soon and was wondering. It's compressed styrofoam. Like really dense styrofoam. You can buy it in a hardware store very easily. It's cheap. And it's very good. Kate, Caitlin, Kate, Caitlin, Caitlin. Nips. Nippy. Nips. Um, <laughs> Nippy. It would have been prettier if it was alive. That's true. Oh, that, that's a good one. Cash, crash Burnley Cut. Singing handedly, the worst tutorial ever. I'm sadistic, but I'm not stupid with the taxidermy. Do some actual research before making an inadequate video. But thanks, man. Look at this. Look at this wonderful, wonderful knitting procedure. Isn't it wonderful over here? Wow, cool. So you put that down. That should work. Now you get your pheasant and you just lumps around over there. And then you see you have no no fat. Wow! 
Na, boah. Should be okay. Now we need to wash it. Guys, we need to wash it now. There's a little bit on there. Oh. Oh. But it should be right. <laughs> you dead, right? Are you dead? Don't move. As a safety precaution, I poison the skin once again with just oil on. So now, guys, I have, you know, put that in an old paper, uh, towel and I do with this. And now I will put this in the dryer. So I'm going to use these for the legs because they are a little bit thicker. Let's get the, the pheasant because it is drying and we are ready to go. Ah, not Bowden, you're not paying me anything. So, Bowden, huh? What's this? I don't know. We're going to make a sharp edge over here. Bah, it's a strong one. So, we're going to make a sharp edge over here. Yeah, way easier. Put that in here. Sleeve that back. No! Let's make a little cut over there. There we go. Now, guys, this is going to be very controversial. You don't need to make life harder than it actually is, right? I use electric tape. Right, get a little bit and just tape that in. Right, just tape it. It works so much better. So this one done. We are not going to rebuild any muscles. It's just you won't see it. You won't see it. A wise man once said to me, he's from from Greece. I'm professional taxidermy. You don't, you don't did good job. I'm sorry. That, that is always in my mind when I do taxidermy. But taxidermy is not about good. It's all about doing, you know. If you don't do taxidermy, you can't do ta good taxidermy. That is the thing that I've learned from that comment. So for the head, once again, sharp point over here. Oh, bam. Go all the way back here. Try to push that through the the skull here. There we go. Now we are over here. We make it go down like a new a, 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 a U shape, a U shape. Then we can push it in there. There we go. And. Make it flush. It's very important that it is flush. You see, it's flush. Then we take the hot glue gun and we're just going to fill it up like this. And now we need to wait until it is dried. During that time, I have finished my wonderful body for the mount over here, I think. It could be a little bit too big actually. I need to make a V-shaped slit for the tail. I like that. So I'm going to cut that as well. Now I'm going to sand that really quickly so it looks a little bit better. Perfect that into the trash. Now we're going to rebuild the neck. You see it? You don't see it, guys. There we go. We're going to make it this long. Should be right. We are going to leave it over there. Did you see it? Not too sure. So now we're going to get clay. So we're just going to plop that in there, actually. Mm. 
Do you want to get a little bit closer to me? Okay. And uh, now we are getting yellow eyes. Have to use these. A little bit big, but I don't care. Just plop them in there. Now I'm going to put that a little bit forward. Because birds look a little bit forward. There we go. Just a tiny little bit. We need to cut a V-shape. Completely forgot about that. Like that. Now we have the V-shape. We're going to plug it in there. All the way through. All the way through. This one will come in here. Perfect. You see it? Guys, you need to say something if you don't see it. And this one on the other side. In there. Move a little bit U shape into the body. I'm going to hit it once or twice with the hammer. Looks neat. U shape back into the body. U shape into the body and another U shape. And into the booty, and another one into the booty. Some hits with the hammer. And now we're going to knit it together. So be right back. Perfect. Now I just have to do this one. So I'm going to make So I'm going to make a quick uh, platform Okay, that should fit now Like this. Now we have four holes and a hole over here. We get a little bit of wire that is left. Make a U shape into that hole. Get the hammer. Hammer a few times over there. Put it through the other hole. The hammer. And we have a way to hang this up. Then we get this. Put it in the metal. No! What the fuck? This drill is fucked. I don't know why. And there you have a wonderful base. Now I can finish the face hunt. This is it sitting over there. Um, I want it, maybe, I'm going to have a look. Maybe I want to let it sit. Or just looking at it. I'm not too sure, do I want to let him sit like this? This will come up. So yeah, I'm going to fiddle around a little bit. And when I'm done, we see us again, because that will take some time. And I think the video is really long already. So be right back, guys. Now there are a couple of weird things that I need to fix. One are these feathers over there. I'm not completely too confident with the eyes. They are a little bit too big, as I already said. It isn't looking that on point yeah i need to do a little bit more feathering but i think it should it should be all right all right but yeah if you liked the video consider subscribing 
And as I already said, live streams, Discord, everything is up to date. Can't stop. I can't stop. I will stop. So that is going to be it, my boys. Um, bye bye. Have a great day.